Breaking news, Nigerians. Senate President Godun Okbabi will tell senators that money has been sent to their account to enjoy holiday amid rising poverty in Nigeria. These people, they are very funny. Our leaders are wicked. They are busy sharing money to themselves. When Nigerians are in this unbearable hardship, we don't even know when, to, when it's going to end. Very wicked set of people. They will tell Nigerians to sacrifice. What are these people sacrificing? Which kind of work serve than they do for that Senate? Which kind of job than they do for that Senate? All of them are happy. Then they share money. Nigerians, they suffer. Where are now? People, when they clap for APC government, Jagaban! Jagaban! This is just the beginning. They say he gets experience. He knows how to, you know, to change every situation. Now, where are we today? Okbabio made this revelation in a video which went viral on Wednesday morning. While addressing his colleagues before the adjournment of a motion moved by one of the senators. What a shame. What a shame. This man supposed to, to resign now. Hmm? But you know, say in Nigeria, that one day, you know they happen. Welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for always coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. Senate President Godun Okbabio has confirmed that undisclosed amount of money have been sent to members of the upper legislative chamber to use to enjoy their holidays. Okbabio made the revelation in a video which went viral on Wednesday morning while addressing his colleagues before the adjournment of a motion moved by one of the senators. In the viral video, Okbabio said, in order to enable all of us to enjoy our holidays, a token has been sent to our various accounts by the clerk of the National Assembly. But when his statement sparked a rowdy moment on the floor of the Senate, he rephrased the statement and said, I withdraw that statement in order to allow you to enjoy your holiday. The Senate President has sent prayers to your mailbox to assist you to go on a safe journey and return. This comes amid rising inflation. And as to medical rise in price of food in markets which have subjected Nigerians to deeper poverty, especially since the removal of first subsidy by President Bola led uh, President Bola Metinubu led government. Before the president directed the review of palliatives to cushion the effect of the first subsidy removal on Nigerians, extremely poor Nigerian household were promised 8,000 naira monthly for six months, while the Senate and the House of Representatives plan to spend 40 billion on vehicles for members. At least, 107 units of the 2023 Toyota Land Cruiser model and 358 units of the 2023 Toyota Prado model would be procured for federal lawmakers. Hmm. Well, <laughs> this is what they've been doing, you know. Just because he said it now, he mistakenly said that this is what they have been doing without announcement. The question is, are we angry because he said it out or we are angry because this has been going on? Let's drive our anger rightly, Shaq. All men to himself, only us to ourselves. And God for us all. That sums up the story of Nigerian poli political uh, leadership. He later called it prayer sent to their mail. Can you imagine that? We should meet our senators and collect our prayer points. If that be the case, they should leave this man alone. No, this is not the one 
that started it because that started it before because he mentioned it in the public the best senate president so far that is why they can do anything to get there no shame no integrity no concern for the citizens i am not surprised or disappointed because i have no hope in this present nigeria i am not even expecting anything from them my comment here just to while away time if nigeria wants to be good fine if she wants to be destroyed i wish her the best my own is to just sit and watch hmm. this is our problem in nigeria only the politicians are the ones enjoying nigerian leaders are the best jarring now them fit nigerians keep enjoying a bag that is what you guys have been doing. That is inevitable. I earlier said it, that starting from Tinubu down, all of them are criminals. Some of them have been convicted. I weep for Nigerians. But because of tribalism, people do not want to, to see the truth about Bola Tinubu's government. The removal of first subsidy is another form of corruption. For the political class to have enough money to their diaspora to embarrass them from frying pan to fire i always blame the electorate and not the few political class we must learn our lesson by force hmm emmy loco renew hope for sure nigerians are proud of you right on subsidy is good subsidy is gone palliatives we could show the effects okay guys these are some reactions from nigerians so i beg what is your take make we hear from you kindly share your thoughts below the comment section and don't forget to give us a thumbs up thank you